people yell out of their car, ma'am, you have a bear in your backyard. <laughs> he was a hundred pound puppy going around your house. We got him at nine weeks and he's just been attached to me <laughs> since then. Napoleon is a really chill dog. He's just really calm and laid back. He plays with another noof and it always reminds me of walruses. The majority of their playtime is just them laying down. <laughs> I just think he's such a gentle giant. Somehow he always knew that I might have needed him. We never really saw Napoleon's protectiveness until I was pregnant. No matter where I went, he wanted to go. Always wanted to sleep by my side of the bed or in the bed with me. My pregnancy wasn't easy. I had vertigo in the beginning and he was there as a support for me to lean against. I was diagnosed with depression. It was something that blindsided me. Everyone was really excited, but I didn't feel that excitement. We would go for a lot of walks and he was constantly checking back on me and looking back at me. Every day on our walks, we passed by the ocean. I would look out and my thoughts were really dark and I couldn't get out of it. One day I got too close to the cliff's edge. He pulled my arm backwards to a bench where we always rested and laid his head on my lap and I just sat there petting him and I cried. He actually saved my life. After that he always seemed to stay a little closer to me you a nudge on my leg and he's here. I'm doing a lot better now when my son just turned three. He also became my son's biggest protector. And when the baby would cry at night, he would pop up immediately like, what's going on with my baby? <laughs> he's always wanting to make sure that my son's okay. He will bark to alert people. He will generally put himself in front of my son. And we kind of wonder about that too. If that bond was established while I was pregnant. They just always want to be near each other. People see me in the garden, especially the front yard. They're like, oh, how do you have flowers around? It's like, they're persistent because Napoleon has walked over everything. <laughs> I started out wanting a big dog as a pet, but I ended up with a companion that is always by my side and ended up being my hero as well. He really is an angel, <laughs> in the shape of a Newfoundland, but it's the best kind. <laughs>